it's Lucas, uh, Survivor Dude here. With another cabin video, I'm gonna be quickly going over how uh, to finish a ballast rod system or handrail on the stairs. So I started at a stair video showing how to construct the stairs. I'm just gonna quickly be going over how to finish the handrailing. So let's take a look at what we've got. This is what it looks like right now. Um, again, this is how I left it the hand railing here in my other video. So I've got the groove and the underside of my hand railing here. And basically what's gonna happen is I've got all of my spindles cut. They're one inch by one inch, which is the width of my groove in the back. Um, I'm going to lay them out. So I have one starting just behind the nosing on every step. And then I'll just split the difference between those two and I'll have a middle one. Same distance on all the steps. I'll do that with the upper flight as well. <coughs> and then I'll dive the railing into the roof there. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll be doweling the bottoms, pre-drilling and doweling, and then cutting fillets to go in top here to hide this groove that's not being used. So anyways, just gonna get going and you'll be able to see the process and how this takes shape. Alrighty, well there's one little run done. Um, again, super easy, looks super sweet. I'm loving the way it's turning out, but uh, the process, uh, I don't know if you can see by the time lapse, but anyways, uh, these middle ones in the middle of each tread, this one, this one, this one, and that one, there's four of them, and they're all exactly the same cut, same length and everything. If you did your stairs properly um, and your railing, um, so those were super easy. Same with these ones on the end of the tread. By the nosing, there's three of them and those are all exactly the same, so cut those ones. I just held them in place, leveled it and marked it. Um, and then I've been cutting my little uh, fillets underneath so you don't see that big groove. These ones are a little proud. Um, you know, it's a bit of a pain in the butt, but there's nothing I can do about it now. It's not a huge eyesore, um, and it is a lighter, a little bit lighter, um, so it goes with these spindles. But anyways, and then I drilled, uh, pre-drilled and doweled the bottoms of all of these so they're not gonna be kicking out. Um, I would cut and insert my fillet would be my first step, glue it. I do one pin in the bottom because the top can't come out once your uh, spindle's in here. And then I put glue my spindle uh, with the dowel, put the dowel end in first, squeeze it down, pull this, the spindle tight up to the fillet. And then you do a pin in the top to keep that from coming out. And then you move on with your next one. Fillet, spindle, fillet, spindle, fillet, spindle all the way up and then you've got a sweet little staircase ballast rod system. So anyways, looking super sweet. Just gonna carry it up all the way up and around. Uh, and then uh, I'll let you see what the finished product looks like.
super sweet. Um, yeah, I just stained it all. So that was good, get that all done out of the way. It's a pain in the butt, have to go around each one. Um, but anyways, uh, spacing, uh, I could have done three or four spindles in between here. Uh, if I were to do four though, it was gonna be a lot tighter. Uh, so I went with three, it was the closest to what I already have. I tried to match it as good, best as I could over here. Um, the angles on these guys were tough. I just had to kind of play around uh, until I got them to work, but looking good. Got all of our fillets underneath. So it's all looking nice and finished. So I'll show you from the bottom. Looks pretty sweet. Well, that's it for this video, uh, really quick, but again, looking nice, getting some stuff done. Uh, this is probably gonna be my last video for quite a while um, up at the cabin. Uh, there's, what's next is really just a lot of decorating. Um, I do need to make a table, um, do a bunch of other stuff, but I need to be able to get the quad up here. Um, and I will be, getting back to work, uh, going hard, so I won't have a lot of free time. So I just wanted to finish this, kind of the last major construction in the cabin here. And uh, I've got some tongue and groove and stuff to do outside, but again, I'm gonna probably wait for it to warm up a bit. It's pretty miser miserable working outside. Uh, but anyways, I uh, hope you enjoyed the videos so far. Uh, it's looking really good. Thank you guys for your uh, support and commitment watching all these. I uh, hope they're helpful if you were deciding to do something like this. Uh, but anyways, thanks again for watching. Have a great day. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.